You're my world, your every breath. Priscilla Black was born Priscilla Maria Veronica White. She was born in the Vauxhall District of Liverpool on May 27th, 1943. She was raised in a Roman Catholic household and attended St. Anthony's School in Scotland Road. As Black grew up, she became determined to become an entertainer. She gained a part-time job as a cloakroom attendant at Liverpool's Cavern Club, best known for its connection with the Beatles. Her impromptu performances impressed the Beatles and others. She was featured in an article in the first edition of a local music newspaper by the paper's publisher, Bill Harry, who mistakenly referred to her as Scylla Black rather than her real name, Priscilla White. Black subsequently decided to keep the name. She signed her first contract with longtime friend and neighbor, Terry McCann. Her father had also subsequently signed her with Brian Epstein. Her first single charted 35 in the UK. Her second single, released at the beginning of 1964, was a cover song of Anyone Who Had a Heart, which had been written for Dionne Warwick. The single beat Warwick's recording into the UK charts and rose to number one in Britain in February of 1964, spending three weeks there. Anyone who ever loved could look at me know that I love you Anyone who ever dreamed Could look at me And know I dream of you Knowing I The song sold 800,000 UK copies in the process. Her second UK number one shortly after Anyone Who Had a Heart was called You're My World. You're my world, you're every breath I take. You're my world, your every move I make Other eyes see the stars up in the skies But for me they shine within your eyes As the trees reach for the sun above so my arms reach out to you for love With your hand resting in mine I feel a power so
with your hand resting in mine. I feel a power so divine. You're my world, you are my night and day. You're my world, your every prayer I pray. If our love seems as to me, then it's the end of my world, end of my world, end of my world for me. Black's song is still popular as of the 21st century, with a major actress and singer, Anya Taylor-Joy, performing You're My World in one of her cover albums. The song was a big hit in America. It was also used in a movie soundtrack. You're my world, your every breath I take. also enjoyed chart success with the song in America, Australia, New Zealand, Europe, South Africa, and Canada. Both songs, You're My World and Anyone Who Had a Heart, sold over 1 million copies worldwide and were awarded gold discs. Black's two number one successes were followed by the release of another Lennon and McCartney composition, It's For You, as her fourth UK single. It was her third top ten song in a row. I'd say someday I'm bound to give my heart away when I do. It's for you. The song proved to be another success for Black, peaking at number seven on the UK charts. Black belonged to a generation of British female singers, which included Dusty Springfield, Helen Shapiro, Petula Clark, Sandy Shaw, Marianne Faithful, and Lulu. Black's version of You've Lost That Love and Feelin' A song that she recorded in 1965 reached number two on the UK charts. Black was also recognized to have achieved a popular status in the USA. More of her hits include 
surround yourself with sorrow. What do you do when your love breaks up? Do you fall apart like a buttercup? Forget about tomorrow. Surround yourself with sorrow. What do you do when your love breaks up? Do you fall apart like a buttercup? Forget about tomorrow. Surround yourself with sorrow. Step inside love. Where is tomorrow? Where is tomorrow for someone like me? There's no tomorrow for a memory. I lost a lifetime. What can I do? Something tells me something's going to happen tonight. Something tells me something's going to happen to you. The smile on my face is the smile you will wear in a moment or two. So get it together, you see, it's going to be all right. Later in her career, in 1993, she released Through the Years, an album of new material featuring duets with Dusty Springfield, Cliff Richard, and Barry Manilo. Black had a big hit with Dusty Springfield in the album, and the song was called Heart and Soul. was back in 63 
Sadly, in 2015, following the results of an autopsy, Black's sons confirmed that she had a stroke following a fall in her home. A pathologist's report confirmed that Black had suffered a subarachnoid hemorrhage after falling backwards and hitting her head, presumably on a terrace wall. It was believed she had not been found for at least four hours. On August 1st, 2015, at the age of 72, Black died at her holiday home in the Spanish town of Estepona.